Hello friends, myself Professor Mas Sayyad. I am a teacher and an academician. So as you know, you know I am going to discuss many things about the CMAT examination. And in my previous video, I have made you understand that what is the syllabus curriculum of CMAT and how to crack the CMAT examination with 250 plus marks. So in this section, we are going to discuss that how to crack the section of quantitative technique and data interpretation. So the first and foremost, एक चीज समझिए, ठीक है? ये basic अगर maths आता है आपको, आपको अगर basic maths के formula आते हैं, थोड़े बहुत theorems आते हैं, थोड़े बहुत riders आपको पता है, you know, if you are knowing the basics of mathematics, this is actually a cakewalk for you. और अगर नहीं आते, कोई बात नहीं, देख लीजिए एक बार. जो पुराने जितने भी इक्वेशंस हैं, जितने भी फॉर्मूलास हैं, जितने भी थ्योरम्स हैं, जस्ट जस्ट गो थ्रू वंस। इफ यू जस्ट गो थ्रू वंस, यू विल डेफिनेटली बी एबल टू क्रैक इट। एंड अपार्ट फ्रॉम दैट, द बेसिक रिक्वायरमेंट, यू नो, फॉर दिस क्वांटिटेटिव टेक्निक्स एंड डेटा at least you are able to calculate the square roots and the cube roots of the numbers lying in the range of 1 to 15. So, and you know, the basic calculation, uh, basic quick calculation like uh, addition, deletion, uh, multiplication, division, fractions, proportions, etc. etc. Et so, if you are well versed with all of these things, you know, now, uh, like when I talk about this part, uh, quantitative techniques and this uh, data interpretation now this section is actually dominated by quantitative techniques questions most of the questions they are going to be asked they are about the quantitative techniques and there are a few questions uh, about the data interpretation so uh, if roughly i can uh, share the share of both of the things like 60 to 70 percent of the questions will lie in the quadrant of quantitative analysis and quantitative techniques and rest would be of the data interpretation so you know uh, here spend a good quality time in just gaining the knowledge about the concepts of mathematics concepts of calculation theorems and formulas and apart from that the next part is that you know just try and analyze the sample questions and just try to solve the sample questions as fast as possible Again, in CMAT examination, you are going to get proper timing for all the things. But here also, the calculation should be fast enough. Apart from the calculation, uh, just try and figure out some sample papers as you have the sample papers of CMAT 2021, CMAT 2020, CMAT 2019, CMAT 2018 and CMAT 2017. So last five year question paper, just check them, just try, just uh, do just calculate and just figure out that you are good or not if you are not you will be able to understand where you need to work hard and practice a lot you know practice will definitely make you ace the quantitative techniques and data analysis topics apart from that just try to figure out just try to search the solutions just try to figure out all the things from the available content then next and foremost thing, you know, uh, just try and solve as many things as possible, as many numericals as possible, as many uh, products, as many sums, as many articulations or as many sections you have and just try to figure out all the things. Just you must be aware of the square cubes, cube roots, square roots of the numbers at least 1 to 15 and if you want to score really well you must be aware of 1 to 100 then apart from this thing you know uh, just in order to reach to the minimum sectional cutoff you know uh, the next thing that we have to understand that we must be memorizing all the formulas like the Pythagorean theorems apart from that the formulas such as uh, a square plus b square is equals to what a plus b whole square is equals to what a cube plus b cube is equals to what and a plus b whole cube is equals to what you know you should be very well versed with all the formulas and when i talk about the data interpretation you know you again can score well in this uh, part just by interpreting the data for instance there would be the tables there would be the graphs by uh, pie chart uh, bar chart histograms 
you know and then just different different sort of uh, uh, charts the data uh, graphical data representation everything would be there you just have to interpret that what they are actually telling you so you know uh, by keeping all these things in mind i know you are going to definitely crack the cmat examination and you will be able to just clear the examination like a breeze and one more thing that you have to keep in mind like you know i would love to share with you that in order to create in order to clear this uh, section of the cmat uh, apart from all this memories and all that there are certain tricks there are certain tips which you should understand you know and in order to understand that tricks and tips you know we are going to link certain uh, shortcuts in the description just go through it and just have your dream career embarked thank you so much for watching this video if you are liking our content a sub to the channel would be very great and a like to this video is much anticipated I hope you like this video. For more such videos, keep watching our channel and do not forget to like, share and subscribe.